In this video, I am going to show you how to do the setup of your Epson Workforce 7310 printer with the Macbook. So I am going to connect it with the Wi-Fi network using the Macbook and we will also install the drivers for this printer. So first step is to switch on the printer and go to your Macbook, go to the web browser Type in www.epson.com slash support slash WF7310 and enter. Select Epson website with your printer. You will see your printer name and photo. Wait for the operating system to show up and download the recommended driver and utility combo package. So click on the download. Open file, open, double click on the Epson installer, open, accept terms and conditions. You can deselect or select these options and go next. Switch on your printer and select the method you want to use. For example, I am going to use the connect by the wireless Wi-Fi network. Next. Next, so we have to follow some instructions here. So go to the printer screen, scroll ahead and look for the Wi-Fi and press OK. Press OK for the router. Start setup. Go to others. Wi-Fi auto connect and start setup. Now click next until you see the final option that is here start setup now click next it may ask you to automatically join with the Wi-Fi network so just allow now select the required software and you can also add the additional if you want and click on the install On the next screen it will display printers and scanners so click on the plus button here select it and click on the add button so that is just at the last so we have added our printer now close this window print test page go to the macbook screen so we have completed our setup process you can close this window and click next next You can select the extended service plan and click next. Now you can finish and register your product. So you can also close this window if you don't want to register it. So we have completed the setup process. We have installed the drivers and softwares for this printer. So this way we can do the setup using a Macbook. Thanks for watching.